Hey guys, I'm making this video about why you shouldn't preoccupy your mind with conspiracy theories, um, unless it's completely necessary, um, or you're a conspiracy theorist, um, so I'd say the only time you really need conspiracy theories is if you're a conspiracy theorist, and also if you have to use um, a conspiracy theory in some sort of test at school or just some some sort of project outside of being a conspiracy theorist but besides that there's not really any reason to preoccupy your mind with conspiracy theories and I'll tell you why it's because um, I mean conspiracy theories are pretty much just ways at looking at the world and life um, in general um, just taking a look at the world through different lenses that aren't proven to be true um, and they can honestly uh, some of them are not too far-fetched and can settle rather, rather well with the mind but some that are even not too far-fetched can inspire you to even think even further things and then get really confused um, but the, the thing is is that um, none of this is necessary and what I'm trying to say is that conspiracy theories, they just get the mind working. They get the mind working really hard. Um, and if you want peace, then what you're going to need is you're going to need a quiet mind. You're going to need the opposite of conspiracy theories. You're going to need the lack of conspiracy theories if you want to feel peace in your heart. Um, and to achieve this peace, you're going to need to live in the present moment, enjoy the present moment, enjoy life in the now, um, and just appreciate what you have and the beauty all around you. Um, see you guys this video. Bye.